Hi. So today I want to do a what's in my bag video. My bag isn't very special, but I love watching what's in my bag videos on YouTube. I'm not really sure why. I think I get ideas about what people carry and maybe I want to carry that or I just like to see what's in there or sometimes I'm just really shocked that people are willing to carry that much stuff around with them. I pretty much try to keep a simple uncluttered bag with not a whole lot in it. Um, my bag isn't like super exciting looking. I know some people have really cute purses, but I look for like three features. Is it a crossbody? Is it does it have like organizational compartments so they can organize my things so they can find them quickly? And um, is it lightweight? Because when you put stuff in the purse, it already gets heavy, or it's already gonna be heavy. So why do you want to carry a heavy purse too? I got over that a long time ago. So hands-free organization, lightweight. Um, I like this bag. It's a travel-on bag. So like I said, it's nothing special. I used to have a different travel-on messenger crossbody bag that I liked, but the strap broke after years, and um, then it was discontinued. So this was the next closest thing I could find, and it's not like you know adorable, but I don't think it's ugly. It's purple. That's nice. Uh, this one has like all of these safety features because you know it's meant for traveling. Um, although I don't know where you travel where you would need all these safety features, but it has like a little buckle so that you can close the zippered compartment so people can just run by and unzip them. The strap has like a wire built into it so people can't just slash a purse. And um, what was the other safe? Oh, this thing. It has like a carabiner. That, I think that's what these are called that you can unscrew and then loop around like a chair or something so that people can't just run by and like snatch your purse. It's like attached to something. So yeah, that's what the outside of the bag has. Uh, and it's like water resistant and I like that. And you can just wipe it off. It's like a nylon material. So purse has two front magnetic flat closures. It has this front pouch, which is I think my most frequently used just kind of stuff things in there. Organize later. It has a cell phone pouch, which I really like because your phone is easy to access right there. And then it has a back pouch that you can put something in that you want close to your body. And then it has a really large compartment in the middle. So I'll start off with this. Obviously cell phone there. And then in this first pouch, I have just my keys. That's all I keep in that pouch so that I know where they are all the time and there's nothing else in the way. And in this pouch, I have a little tiny notepad that has a grocery list on it that is really old, but I won't throw it away because I like to use both sides of the paper. Waste not, want not. Some breath spray. And some lip gloss. And that's it. In this pouch, my most used pouch, I have an old grocery list, which I kept because I wanted to use this size. So I'll take that out so I remember to do that. I have a crochet hook that I got out of my desk at work that shouldn't be there. <laughs> I have I have my work lanyard in here, so I'm going to take that out. It's just keys. It says where I work on it, and you don't need to know that. You don't care. Okay. Then I have headphones. Tissues. A Uniball Jetstream pen, which I'm taking out of the purse to leave on my desk. My High Tech C Kaleido Multi pen, which I'm also taking out of my purse to leave on my desk. A little makeup brush, which goes with this, which is a uh, it's like a face touch up palette that I got. 
and I love it. I've had it for a long time, which I'm sure people will say, you should throw it out because makeup's old, but it lasts like forever. And it's exactly what it's for, is for touch-ups. So I have this little tiny brush. It's an ultra fine eyeliner brush. And I use it with this because this is really cool. I'll show you. So it has a mirror on the side that I'm covering, but it has like powder, foundation, concealer, and corrector. And it's all in one little palette. So if you need to touch up throughout the day, you can. And it's, you know, when you buy like the color of the concealer or whatever, they match all the other ones. Um, it's from Bobbi Brown so that you have the matching kit so that you can fix your face whenever you need to. So that I love to keep in my purse. This my bobby pin. It's my little sparkly bobby pin. That's coming out. So, I'll put the rest of that back in later. <laughs> um, let's see. So, no, I'll put this in there, to the side. So then, in the back pouch, it's a really big back pouch. Um, but all I keep in it is my wallet. And again, it has that contrasting fabric. So this wallet, I had gotten with my old travel on bag and I loved it so much even though it's not cute at all it's so functional I had to keep it it's large enough that I can stick my phone and my keys in there if I just want to grab my wallet and go I can have everything in here I can shove most of the stuff that's in my purse in this wallet um, if I needed to and I love that it has a little wristlet strap and then it has this feature that you can um, hook it here so that you can't open the bag all the way or so that you can hook it to something so that you can be hands-free. So in my wallet, it looks like this inside. And so over here, I just keep some cash and coins in this little mesh pocket. Here I have some notes, uh, some like club cards, a little post-it pad in case I don't have my purse and I need to write something down, some coupons, and all my cards, health insurance, credit, bank, and driver's license cards, and then uh, a little pen, a little pen holder. So I can fit like a lot in here if I just want to carry my wallet, that's it. So that's my wallet. I wish it matched my purse, but it doesn't. It matched the original, but. So then the main compartment, and it unzips all the way across the top and down the side, which is really cool, because when you want to get in here, you want to get in here so it opens all the way up like that it's nice um i like all the travel on bags i like that all the travel on bags come with a little flashlight that's detachable and it snaps snaps in there and it's really bright so that you can see like what's in your bag <laughs> or for whatever purposes you might need a flashlight i have my sunglasses in here which I bought off the internet because I was looking for the darkest possible tint on glasses I could find and all it came in were these uh, red Oakleys and I never even tried them on before I bought them. I just ordered them because I didn't care how they looked. I have really sensitive eyes and I thought I just need dark lenses and I get so many compliments. Shh. Sorry. <laughs> I get so many compliments on these sunglasses. I think people like the bright red. So I have those in there. I have another old grocery list that I saved because I wanted to write on the back. So I probably need to take those out of my bag so I can use them. I could have saved a piece of paper the last time I went. You can see uh, in the bag that there's like organizational features, uh, which I like. So this, you could put your cards in there. I had my grocery list tucked in there, but I don't usually use this because I have my wallet, which works pretty well. There's two slots here. I carry a pen. This is my purse pen in that one. In this one, I have a little um, a little glass nail file. And then I have um, two pouches on this side and then a zipper pouch. So I have some lotion and I got this from a place that makes it locally and it's the best lotion I use it on my face. It's so good. Um, this was an idea that I got from a What's in My Bag video on YouTube. Some wisps. I never even noticed these in the store before. And somebody on there, quite a few people have them in their bag. 
and I've used them several times, not this particular pack, but um, they'd come in handy. So I bought those and I keep those in my bag now from what's in my bag. My EpiPen. In this pouch, I have a little old bottle of peppermint oil for headaches. I have a pill case for extra medication. I have two rubber bands. I have long hair, so rubber bands are a must. Some eye drops. Something else now. Hand sanitizer. Nothing else in there. Down at the bottom. Excedrin, in case the peppermint oil doesn't work. Let's see, I'll show you that in just a second. This zippered compartment, just uh, feminine products. And this is like the last thing that's in my bag, which is really cool, so I'll show you. Um, like I said, I don't really like to keep a very cluttered bag. So I found this, I think it was at Ross. And it came in this little tin, and it's it seals pretty well. And so I bought it, and I didn't really know what was in it. I think it just said something, what did it say? my tag alongs and it just said like purse accessories I thought I'll get it it was like a dollar ninety nine or something so you open it and it's tin and I've only added a couple things to it the rest of it it came with so in it um, it came with a pair of tweezers that you can use in a pinch they're not that great I added earplugs which I've used more than anything else in this tin they're wonderful I keep those in there. I added, no, I think it came with a rubber band inside. It did come with a rubber band. Uh, it came with a band-aid. I think it actually came with two band-aids, but there's one left because I used the other one. I added toothpicks. It came with two of these flosser toothpick things. Toothpick. I think I added this safety pin. It came with uh, well, more toothpicks. Uh, it came with this nail file, but I like the glass one better. That works in a pinch. And then it came with this sewing kit with pre threaded needles two black, two white, and a red and a blue. And it has a little safety pin in there, and it has two buttons in there. So that's pretty cool. And then it came with, um, I think this is called Hollywood tape. It's like clothing tape so if like the front of your shirt is kind of popping open or whatever you can use that and it will stick it together so that it stays together in one place so that's it that's everything that I carry in my purse minus the crochet hook which is not usually there or uh, the extra pens because those are my desk pens but other than that that's everything that I carry in my bag on a daily basis so, I hope you found it interesting, um, even though there's not that much stuff to look at, that is what I carry every day. So I hope you have a nice day. Bye.